Peoples. I'm here with Nick. What does it mean to judge a book by its cover? It's like a girl with glasses, you're like, ah, she's a nerd. And like, but well, like. There's an example of what's the definition? Uh, I don't know. English idiom, don't judge a book by its cover, is a metaphorical phrase, which means you shouldn't prejudge the worth or value of something by its outward appearance alone. Mm. New question. How many people, in percent wise, do you think judges people, like people in general, judge a person by its cover? 97%. Other things you judge about someone? Their noses and their ears. Their facial features. Can you judge? I don't know. Like <laughs> That's like their features. You can judge someone by how they walk. You could like, oh, they walk this way, so that means they're this, or they did this, or, or they like done their this. Hair. You or can judge them by the how um their personality. Or no. If they're an extrovert, or introvert. If they're super shy, then you're gonna be like, oh, they're they're a nerd. They're really smart. They're this. If someone's all super like out there. Oh my and plus it's difference between genders too. If a girl's like that, like, oh, she's just weird. Like, oh, thinking like random things. Another thing you could judge face. is why someone's voice, right? Yeah, you can do that, which you keep putting into, which is like their nerdiness. But everyone has their own tone, but it's super deep. What do you think? And a guy has a super deep tone. How would you take that as? Like, like intelligence wise. Like yeah. And if it's a girl who has a deep voice, what do you think? It's a lot tomboy. Okay, and if a girl had a super high, high voice or high slash like a ditzy like, like she's blonde. And her intelligence? Not smart at all. <laughs> so if you already see someone walking by, you think that you could already tell what they are just by sexuality. Yeah. I have some pictures for you to pick. Based on wow. features of what of sexuality, do you know who this is? No. You don't know who that is? You'll no. see it on the screen, too. No, I don't know. You don't know who that is? On Transformers? Oh, is that Megan? Megan Fox? Fox? Why well, she changed? She looks the same as she did in the movies. No, she she just had less dirt covered. Okay, that's Megan Fox. Okay. What would you say her sexuality is? A girl. Sexuality. What is it? Which means straight? gay, bi, lesbian, transgender, um, um asexual. Straight. What what would you say if I said that she wasn't? Well, she was hooking up with Sam. And Does it movies. matter? Movies are things. Uh, You're an actor and actress. You do the part. You play straight? the part. She's actually a bisexual. Which means she likes guys and girls. Uh, do you know who this is? Uh, Sarah's. Okay. She's working. She's not. What? Oh, she's bisexual. Nope. She's actually pansexual. So she doesn't like anybody? She's not limited in a sexual choice with regard to biological sex, gender, or gender identity. So she, she doesn't care if like if people are like, oh, I don't like guys, I don't like girls. Hers is, I like everyone, basically. Uh, um, I don't know who that is. You don't even know who, you're not gonna know who that is. It's a YouTuber. That's a YouTuber? Mm-hmm. Do I know that YouTuber? No, I don't think so. Oh, well. You might have heard her about that. I don't know. Straight. Straight what? She's like straight. <laughs> she's straight what? What's like, her gender? Oh, she's female. Well, what if I said that? Oh, no, transgender. Well, you can't change it now. You already do that. Change it. This is actually who she was before. That's Gigi Gorgeous. What about... <laughs> Channing Tatum, you know who this is? The title is right there. You know, I'm pretty sure that guy's like, like Shadow the Buff or something. <laughs> yeah, Jenny like Tatum. the box is right down below. And Channing Tatum straight. What if I said he wasn't? Mom's heart will be broken. <laughs> Says the Magic Mike star and recent Dilf may be happily married to actress Chema Duin. Who he might want to set a step up, but that doesn't mean he isn't by. Tatum reportedly started his career oh, as a stripper and took on many gay roles. He openly admitted his sexual preferences on several interviews and Twitter. How many may say Americans have close friends or relatives who are gay? Well, out of 10.
Uh, uh, ten people. How many people do you think? Four. Four out of what? Out of ten. You're right. Four out of ten. Americans have close friends or relatives who are gay. Anyway. Shoot. Oh. <laughs> my luck. How, what would you say about yourself? I don't know what real voice is. Yes. No, you can hear when you hear yourself. You know, like I hang out when I say, "Um." Yes. Um. I don't know. I sound normal now. Normal. Yeah. Is there such thing as normal? Yeah. No, like you. <laughs> Wait, don't watch me. You answer the question. I said, "How would you say? What would you think of yourself?" Oh, walk by a street. I think I'm straight. Why are you walk away? Right? Stay in the view of the camera. Straight. Okay, and then there's me. Why are you laughing like that? <laughs> yeah. You wouldn't make fun of me, old dude. Pansexual. You're pansexual. <laughs> Which means what? You like everything, even Marks. I hate everyone. Oh. Then you're unpansexual. No. That would be I'm really, you sound straight. I sound straight? Yeah, straighter than a line. Uh, whoa! <laughs> what if I told you you were wrong? You're gay? You are? I'm gay. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Sit down. <laughs> no. I can't, I can't handle this now. Are you serious? I support you. <laughs> sit down. <laughs> sit down. Nicholas, sit. I'm not kidding, it's right. When did Kayla talk to you? Don't say that. Oh, sorry. What's it called? Well, Kaylee, that was like a long time ago. But she wouldn't even talk to me. We were at, what's it called? We were at AutoZone. I was like, hey, yo, Kaylee, let me get some medicine candy. <laughs> uh, and she was like talking. One of their workers was like, Blah blah blah, something about like gay or something. Uh, and Kaylee's all like, oh, yeah, blah blah blah, something. She said something, and I was like, hey, that's, that's me. I'm not about gay people like that. She's like, one picture do gay. Wow. I, I don't know, she didn't say it like that. <laughs> <laughs> You're throwing her into the bus. Uh, I mean, she said it like, yeah, I think you're doing gay. And what did you think of it? I was like, I actually thought, I was like, maybe, I don't know. Then I was like, no, it's probably bisexual. <laughs> But then I was like thinking like, yeah, but all stuff like, oh, he sounds good. <laughs> not like your Yeah, voice, so you're judging when, me by sound. Remember how we had this when conversation? Like, well, this we had this conversation before upstairs, and you were saying, I can tell. Like, like you know, when someone talks, like, you can just tell when they're well, straight. No, mostly whenever you're with, like, Melissa. Oh, no. Oh. And like Melissa and Victoria. When I'm actually myself? Well, normally, like, you're, you though, you don't really act like it, though. Like, there is no way you can act like it though. Well, there, like, that's the thing. There isn't well, no, like, a stereotype. Well, not like stereotype, but most it's like, like, well, I'm, I'm only like, I never really met like a lot of gays, but like most of them basically. Well, obviously, my it's, what, it's what you've seen in your friend. Yeah. It's not someone that you've known your whole life. Well. And <laughs> someone you're, are you not close to me? Yeah. Obviously, it's not. It's never affected you. Because you didn't have to, I really have to think about it. Why do you think I always said that about adoption? Because I always wanted to be in No, why do I, do you think I always said that? Oh, because I don't know. You know, you said, hey, they will give birth with me. Oh, yeah, I'm going to adopt. Why do you think I said that? Why do you think every time you said, Dylan, you're never going to get a girl? I'm like, yeah, Nick, I'm not going to get one. Oh, you make reals? I was telling you. I was with you. Okay, that's matter. I was saying all that time, I wasn't lying. I never lied about it. I'm saying, don't judge a book by its cover because. You can have your suspicions, but you don't know, do you? Okay, peace out, people. Yeah. I'll see you in the next video. And you will see what happens next. Okay, boy.